welcome back to my channel I got a quick tip for you today working on my board and everyone well most of us do use this battery indicator right here it comes in blue or green doesn't matter you'll recognize it it's pretty much 90% of uh, the boards will have one of these and it does have this cable really thin cable that plugs into your display and these two ends actually do get plugged or soldered onto yeah and by the way that annoying sound in the background is the uh, washing machine if you're wondering and after plugging the screen these two silly little cables will be soldered onto main power cables of your board this is how the wiring diagram shows it to be and this is what you're going to have but now let's imagine you're wrapping all of this stuff into your enclosure you're gonna put a cover over it and everything will be vibrating and working away when you are gushing and running on your board great but now the cables provided are actually really really thin you can easily strip this cable just using a nail look at this the plastic coating on the cable itself is very fragile so if you have this cables laying inside your enclosure and they are rubbing on something there is a potential that these two cables could connect the positive and the negative because it is connected to your board and to your battery and short out so what I'm gonna do before I will install these cables inside my enclosure very simple solution a cheap set of heat shrink tube and I'm adding a bit of more protection on these cables so giving them another skin don't have any red well I'll put some blue doesn't really matter and here we go from just the skinny little cables to a beefier protected cables you don't have to follow this guys but this takes 30 seconds and costs you pretty much nothing why not to be safe that's it for this video guys please like please subscribe follow me on instagram and also hit the bell button because you'll see every time i upload my new video that's it build safely and please most importantly ride safely see you soon